Greetings, greetings, everyone. I do hope... Why is that so zoomed in? Hang on a sec. Okay. Give me a second. This has got the wrong thing on it. I hope everybody's having a good Thursday afternoon. I'm kind of taking it lazy. Holy mother of God, that face. Oh, it gets better. Give me a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, that's what it's supposed to be. I don't know why it shifted. Um, that's much better. I love the feathered effect on that. Way better. I hope everybody's having a good Thursday afternoon. Welcome to the Tuesday, Thursday live stream, the 2 p.m. live stream. Um, it's kind of a random spot during random things, and uh, me and Aradani stepped into EverQuest 1 a couple of weeks back. I figured I'd dive back in again and come wander around. I mean, it's not a horrible game. There's tons of content. It's kind of nostalgic going back through some of it. I think it's interesting. Um, apparently, Aradani is inspired enough to join me. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, let's let's go to... Quit scaring people with the eyes and go to game footage. I'm actually going to get some background music on. Uh, this is going to be cropped a little bit weird. You'll see a field of stars across the bottom. That's because um, EverQuest 1 does not want to actually go into... Uh, let's see. Where's the... Where's the play button? Oh, yeah. Interworld. There we go. Um, EverQuest 1 doesn't want to do a uh, borderless windowed mode. Basically, it wants to go full screen windowed, which means I couldn't mouse out of the application to do other things. Don't rush yourself, Aridani. It's cool. It's copacetic. Enter world. Yeah, exactly. But anyway. So yeah, I have to crop it out. I have to actually use a crop filter. Um, let's see. Where... Oh, right here I am. I've got... Larara! <laughs> my Earth Elemental pet. Um, pet info. I'm going to put over here. Managed Mercenaries. Uh, I've got this guy. He's useless. I'm going to... Are you sure you want to dismiss your mercenary? Yep, he's an idiot. Dismiss the dumb dumb, please. Uh, okay. I'm eating a bagel. Sustenance! Yeah, I totally lost track of time. I looked up, it was like 135. I'm like, oh crap. I have a live stream in 25 minutes. I haven't eaten lunch. So I slammed a sandwich down my throat. Uh, so yeah, anyway, we're in EverQuest 1. It's super weird. I gotta remember. Okay, I got bags... Worn Totem, right? That gives me some kind of a buff or something. I gotta remember. Lester Shielding. Oh, here we go. Buffs are, buffs are up here. Right. Um, Lester Shielding. Courage. I think that's something Aridani gave me. Blessing of Swiftness is something he gave me. Um, DOD? H01? I'm not sure what those are. I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it. Okay. Haze, Strengthen, and Courage on my Earth Elemental. That's interesting. Um... Okay. <laughs> There's me crouching. There's Aridani. Boing. It's much more scary going first person. Um, let's see. There we go. Hey. <laughs> this girl was like, no, I don't want to join the voice chat. I, I figured you were busy. I was just going to poke around. 
Uh, I didn't know that you wanted to actually keep joining in. <laughs> I figured I'd log on, make sure my um, mercenary and, and my pet were buffed and whatnot. Um, I, I literally dismissed my mercenary. He was an idiot. So. <laughs> Mm. And there's the wife. Pat. I'm stuffing my set, my face as well, so. Um. Okay. I have use a walk forward and backward animation for my side to side. That doesn't look weird at all. Ah, oh, there we go. Super strange. Okay. Okay. Um, I think I can do Alt eight. Yeah, you can. Okay, you can alt cast spells. Hooray! I gotta remember. That is the first slot and the second slot. Burn. And I got some new spells. Last time. Holy guacamole. Oh yeah, I got a whole bunch of new spells. I have, um, I got Gate, which is super dope. That means I can... Nice. Now, I don't think I have the one that sets your... What was it, Bind? Bind Affinity. Yeah, I don't think I have that one yet. If I remember right, you got that at, like, level 10 or something? And I'm only level like 5? So, basically, I can only come back to this dump. It used to be 10. I remember 10 was the monumental level when you could set your own bind. Pardon me while I chew on camera. I mean, on uh, stream. Now, that was the old days. They might have moved it. God knows they might have moved it. Who knows what they've done to this game. <laughs> uh, bind affinity. I literally haven't played it in 15 years. 14, 15, something like that. Okay. okay, clerics get it at 10, druids, necros, wizards, shamans, no, enchanters and mages get it at 12, mm. shamans get it at 14. Okay, so clerics get it at 10, so they make clerics slightly more interesting and important that way, that's interesting, that's cool. I like that, that's good. Um, I remember uh, my brother played a Shadow Knight, and Shadow Knights actually got Bind Affinity as some of their spells. They used to. I don't know if they still do, but it was pretty... It was being a, a pseudo-warrior class. That was pretty monumental. I'm just going to toss something downrange at this... Uh... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that wow, is something somebody. else. What is that? Fireflux. Oh, right. Point I'm blank AoE. The, the jury... Yeah. The jury is still out on that. I think it's a point blank AoE and not a buff. Well, and I'm asking what color the uh, symbol is, but... <laughs> What's color? <laughs> um, yeah. I don't know. You would have to look on the spell bar on stream. Or somebody else can say something. That's just true. Hey, um, uh, this thing, this fire flux that I got my arrow on. What color is the circle around it, ladies and gentlemen? So it is gonna... purple. It is purple. Put blank AOE. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, quote number two. Thank you, Dragon Racer. <laughs> yeah, they re they were okay. So, so Kuga says they were going to spells levels a while back. Used to be pure magic got spells every four levels, priest classes every five, and hybrids every five after level nine. Yeah, okay. That, that, now, that, that sounds about right. Yeah. Now they're spread over all levels. That's kind of good. I like that. Um. Okay. So I have cave rat. I'm gonna do. Kablam! Get him! And it's dead! That was pretty quick. Is this burly guy yours, or is that a... Oh, that was a guard. No wonder it's dead. Okay, jeez. No wonder it's dead. Plot. That's cheating. Um, okay. I gotta remember real quick... Oh, I, God, how I opened the, uh, quest log. Um... <laughs> what? No, I don't wanna... Would you like to open a browser to help and to the help and petition webpage? Dear God, what have I done? No. <laughs> Quest journal, Alt Q. Uh. Is that what it is? Yep. Maha! Yes. 
Let's move this down. Oh. I'm gonna. Okay, I've got the this... revolt quest. Um, speak to revolt scout Zajir and finish the quest. Scouting Blooming Deep. Okay, there's the revolt of Glooming Deep. Okay. That's the main quest line. <laughs> oh, you're a couple of steps ahead, I think. Because I oh, need to do I need to do finish the quest Spider Caves, finish the quest Rebellion Reloaded. And uh Spider Tamer Kuga, I'm assuming. Yeah. Oh. Uh. So okay, I need to speak to Guard Virin. Um Is he back in the old area or He's back in the old area, yeah. Okay. I think I vaguely remember the way back there. What was it? We go right around this corner? Right. Yep. Yeah. Everything looks so freaking huge. When you use the, like, the zoomed-in camera. Yep. Like uh, first person or whatever. Being a gnome, everything looks massive. <laughs> and being a freaking high up, everything looks tiny. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Um... So this guy, I need to speak to him. Hail. Hail, yes. I want to speak to you. Let's make this bigger. Okay, spider caves. Marine needs as much of Gloom Deep silk. Oh, this is the silk thing. And then there's, wait a minute. Spider Tamer Guggen. I thought I did these. Maybe I didn't. Yes, so I Huh, weird. Okay. Finish the anti-venom... Oh, find the anti-venom violet. Okay. okay, so spider I caves... Those are done for you. Loot for gloom deep cocoon silk. Do I have any of that stuff? Okay. Gloom deep silk. I do not have cocoon silk. That is a lie. I have, co I have cocoon silk. Cool, take it, throw it in. <laughs> so what do I do? I trade? Um, yeah, pick up the item and then give it to him, or whoever it tells you to give it to. I think it's... Uh... Let's do four. Oh, to the uh, Valara check, oh. which is back here. <laughs> no. Okay, so I give it to her. I think they only need four. Yep. Ooh. I got a wristband. I can equip that. Now we do Alt Q. Uh, oh, this is the one where you just keep turning in. Four silk and get an armor piece. Four silk and get an armor piece. I think. Okay. Or maybe I have to do it until I get the whole set. Because, like, I don't have the robe yet, but you do. Okay. So, I guess we need to go back and spend some more time doing... What? There, used to, there used to be a way... To raise your camera view. I right. can't remember. Um. So she ran right up to me and then ran away. I didn't think I was scary, but whatever. Um, okay. <laughs> so okay, the problem with being a gnome, your character is centered on the camera view, right? When yep. you're a, when you're a gnome and you're short, the bottom half of that camera is basically filled with ground. <laughs> Whereas, and this is a problem when a camera views on all games, they do not compensate for height. The camera needs to be raised more in third person if you're a shorter race, or you need to not center the person on the camera. You need to have them lower down on the screen. And there used to be a way yeah. to do this in the old EverQuest where you could change your camera or whatever. I keep wanting to use third person, but I, eh. we'll see. I'll suffer. Um, okay. So I think we need to. I need to go kill a few more of those spiders. Oh, because yeah, you need. You have to get up. Yeah, to get up. You have to go through tasks. The uh, Google yeah. Rebellion Reloaded. I think I need to do those until I finish my armor set. 
Where's my dumb Earth Elemental? There he is. He's actually not dumb. He's smarter than my mercenary. Um, he's made a rock. Yeah, no, which the, is sad. The tier, yeah, no, the tier one mercs are not the brightest. <laughs> yeah, I think we go in here, right? This is where we were killing him. Yep. I can't remember. Do we get the cocoon silk from? The, we don't get the cocoon silk from the spiders. We get them oh, from the actual cocoon. cocoons, right? So we. Here. Uh, that's a pile of bones. I'm. I'm just gonna. Yeah. Whack! <laughs> Fireball! Oh, I should probably actually. Uh, flash. Oh, we need to in. group up. Yep. Flash invite. Oh, no, I, to, I, I sucked at my pet. Damn it! Don't invite in your pet invite. to a party. That's weird. <laughs> There's a dwarf here named Stormax. Great. Stormax. Yeah, the cocoon piles up the rock by the ent entrance. Did I get a thing? Oh. I should have, yep. Uh, I think I do. I, I hit follow. There you go. We're in a group. Point. Okay, there we go. Yay. Now we can get party experience. Up the I was rock. like, why did he get any experience for that kill? That's cool. Um, Up the rock by the entrance. What? Up the ramp. Up the ramp. Oh. Ah. Yeah, so let's go up here. Woo. And then we get these things, ah. target them. And actually use our melee skills, which is just gross, but whatever. <laughs> um Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh and Yep, it's no drop, thank you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Coarse silk and gloom de Okay, I did get some gloom so I was about to say. I'm just gonna come over here and fireball the crap out of this thing. I really need to figure out how to put an attack button on my task bar, on my action bar for, uh. Oops. Um, the hotkey for I think my should my should be by default the uh, grave key one okay. to the left of your one. The hotkey for what? The uh, auto attack. No, I need pet auto attack. Oh, okay. Also, keys. Something really stupid that is bothering the hell out of me. Um, targeting. There you go. Why is tab <laughs> target? Toggle target and myself. That's dumb. Um, nearest. What is nearest? Uh, NPC is F8. Okay, that's what it is. So we do. There we go. I need, need to get used to that, basically. And then ta tab toggles back and forth. You see, I can't command my pet to actually do anything. I don't have, it has to. Uh, uh, you have to get attacked first, right, or something before it can kick into action. Yeah. There is. I, I don't, is it um, attack? No. Um. Hold on. Oh, there it is. Um. Once you have your pet window <clears throat> uh, open, just hold down on the attack button, and it'll make a hockey. Oh, pet attack! Dear God, that is awesome. Okay. Awesome. Honestly. I'm going to put that up there. I don't need to really melee. That's weird. Yay! Much better! What the heck is... What? Chunk of bronze! You already have a chunk of broads. You're a big dubby head. <laughs> um, can we go? Need more. Um. Oh, here we go. Okay, there's more over here. Yay! I need more of the cocoony things. There's two of them. Do that. That. Yeah. See, this is much better. I can fire my pet in and then start winding up the spell. Since the pet starts things off, it'll gain aggro. And, and it'll root, so I can't just go run off. 
Yeah, okay, so now... Uh, I wonder if I can just... Can I... That's not a legal target. I feel like an air yeah, attack. Good luck, now. Thank you. <laughs> Click and hold. That's where yeah. I was arrived. Yeah, Kukas, I'm, uh, uh, yeah, my pet, uh, my pet windows over here, and yeah, I'm, I'm pleased, this is a situation where I want some backseat gaming, because dear God, I don't know what the hell's going on. Um, I, I need help in this game, is what I'm saying. <laughs> I need help? I need help, oh God. Uh, okay, do you want to zappy zap this one too? Alright, and, ah, fizzled, there we go, and, <laughs> boink, mess. Thank you. I can see the little sparkle when it hits him, so I know when I can go past him. Well, if it say he resists, the sparkle effect will still happen, but then he'll come running right at me. <laughs> I attacked that thing three times for no damage. I, I feel like a wimp. Okay, I have four. I'm not sure how many armor pieces this is going to give me, so I'm just going to go get some more. Uh, let's see. These things are these aren't hostile ones, right? The names are different if they're hostile. Like, the, the, their names are brighter or whatever? I can't remember. Um, Let's find so out. if you right-click them, if you right-click them, they'll tell you. Um, uh, both of them are scouts ready to attack. I'm going to assume attack on sight then. <laughs> uh, meds. Boink. Okay, let's do that. Now we do this. This will be six. If I can get two more, I'll probably go back. Oh, it's t task stage completed? What? Oh, that's why I didn't complete the task for you when you turn it in. You have to loot them first. I have to loot them first? Uh, the uh, Blooming Deep's uh, Cocoon Silk, You when, yeah. when, you, when, you, when you turn it in, it didn't actually complete the task. You actually mm. had to have picked it up which completes that stage, and then you turn it in. Okay, so this is done. I need to deliver four more to them. So we can go back and do that. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Before we take off somewhere. Spider Tamer... Here. Spider Tamer Guggen. Uh, he's this way. He was a name mob. It's just Jerk over here, who is not a spider. <laughs> Uh, oh, that guy. Yeah, okay. Sick him. Get him! Let's anger every spider in range. Yep. Back up. I'm going to hit him with a dot. I'm going to enfeeble him. Oh, he's Party dead. Burns. No, do. I still think it's goofy that the uh, the flame effect kicks up, even on friendly mobs, but whatever. Yeah. Okay, so. Oh God. Let's get this and put it over here, over here, over here. Um, yep, Blooming Deep Violet, that's a thing. I mean, that would be the quest item. Okay, I just remembered the order with which things go in bag-wise. So what I want to do is I want to get this bag and put it down here. And it will be the last bag that stuff goes in. The last bag. What is this? Oh, yeah, uh, this is one of these plate helms that you... Picked up and sold for a couple yeah, of Yeah, metric dumb ton of money. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Um, now, what else do you have? Nightpart um, says, uh, hello all, how goes the EQ1 run? Uh, clumsily? Clumsily so far? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, before we leave... Okay, we did uh, gook on. Everything else is guards. It's like, oh, wait a minute, oh. return to guard Ruttis with your news of your success. Okay, so I have a couple I haven't turned in. I finished them, I didn't turn in. I do still have this... I Deliver one class one, it would air, would point That would out. be the Rebellion Reloaded. Uh, so I need to do that one. 
You found those oh. in barrels, I think, right? Yeah, barrels in here. Where's the freaking yeah. exit? There's a freaking exit. Oh, look, AK Brad. Uh, barrel, 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 mushroom. Barrel. Whack. <laughs> Um, I will help you kill it. Oh, there we go. Do you... I'll right-click it to loot it. Uh, this is... Did it have anything? Don't, not much sure. Um... Oh. Nope. I'm gonna say no. We need more barrels. Uh, are there any more up here? Let's go find out. We, uh, I see one. Yeah, Kuga says I just have to remember how to change your pet's name. Um, honestly, I kind of like the default. It's it's um, it is uh, nostalgic for me, like Zabanan and Larara and Goopy stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Um, Ludo. Oh, right here. You find one? Yeah. Yep. At four of them. <laughs> Okay. Loot all. Yes, I guess. Ooh. There you go. Class one, wood point arrow. Awesome. Wait a minute. Am I? Turn some tasks. I got a whole bunch of stuff I need to probably sell off. Okay. Um. So, first one. That's chilling. I think this is going to be all the way back here at the beginning. Yep. In the noob zone. Nub nub zone. In the newbie area of the newbie yeah. zone. <laughs> I need to sit for a minute let my mana regen. I think I'm going to. Yeah, I am. Okay. So this guy, I go up to him and I go, <laughs> hey, hell. Cast complete. Hell. Oh, yes. Hell yes. Okay, uh, so I get um, one arrow and give it to the same guy. Rebellion task completed. Oh, now that you have your bow and arrows songs. equipped, you can perform ranged attacks? No, I can't. Actually, I think you can. You're just very terrible at it. <laughs> oh, Whoever. Did they actually give me a bow? Okay. So now we go to the Lara over here. Double check. Yeah, I already picked up all my spells that I wanted. I double check though. Bard and check. Aha! Uh -huh. I have a robe! A robe! A robe! I'm gonna reshield myself because I can't remember. Um. Okay, let's see. Raw crude hide. Ruined animal pelt. Iron ore. Chunk of bronze. Crude binding powder. I don't think that's something I use. Distillate of celestial healing, too? What? Did they get me a healing potion? What was it? Shift. Oh crap! Yeah, I, I can never remember the actual keybind for uh. There was the, a. The belt. <laughs> there's a keybind for something where you can click and get the information on a on a on an item. You know what I'm talking about? It'll bring up the little info window on a piece of equipment. Oh, uh, hold right click. Oh. Oh, okay. There we go. Yep. Expendable. Just used one. Oh well. Um That means I can put that there. Now that I know how to do this, I can put this there. Um 
Crescent Reach Guild Summons. Actually, can I... Will that show me... Yeah, eight. Okay, awesome. I can see how many of those I have left. Uh, so that's done. Z Deliver the Violet to Zeneda. Oh, the Dark Elf, I think. Ew, Brody. Um, <laughs> dark I mean, Elf. I mean, oh, really? How interesting. Zen oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah, Dark Elf or by the big, big uh, thing. Yeah. The fires. So I need to... Bring level six. From here Whoa. on out, you will lose small fraction of your experience whenever you die. Oh, joy. No oh, joy. Oh, the, 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 the training gloves have come off. <laughs> yep. Whoa, okay. That's weird. Um, saw a lady cosplaying the EQ icon character today on the bus. Oh, that's awesome. Good luck. I will chat with you on the evening Coop Life 2 stream. See you later, Night Pirate. It's Crap, some I need tiny daggers. I need more ice. Um, Fox isn't here, but I have to rub my drinking a fresca in his face. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you know how it is. Okay, I need to go... Hell, I mean, uh, over. Oh my God, what the heck is that? What? Oh, I think it's an ogre. Jeez, it has been so long since I've seen one of those guys. Just freaking massive. <laughs> Wait, where are you at? <laughs> um, I'm by that guy, uh, that chick Valera, right here oh. on the wooden bridge. Oh, the, the giant bald guy, the Octopaw. Octopaw. <laughs> yeah, Octopaw. Octopaw like. Motopaw, sad. Um, <laughs> it's, it's racist. I shouldn't do that. It's an imaginary species racist, but that's it's not ogres. the point. Oh, 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 wait a minute. Uh, actually, first things first, sell. What am I, how am I going to? Oh, yeah, you dinged. Who smells? Woohoo! So, I, I don't think I have any use for that. Sell it. Sell it. Oh, great. That has no use. Um. Spiderling eyes are watching you. Yeah. Crude defiant <laughs> plate helmet. What? Um, you don't like my song? Uh, okay. Crew Defiant Plate Helmet. One Platinum, five Gold. That's just mm -hmm. dumb. Um, let's do level. Okay. <laughs> that means you should be able to buy our spells now. I need to do... Uh, can I just... Let's do that. Top middle. Nope, that's annoying. That's less annoying. Awesome. Okay. I just recently got the overlay for Discord working again. I don't know how or why, but that's not the point. Okay, True North, summon drink. I don't think I'm going to need that, right? Uh... Spell effect conjures a bolt of light that illuminates the area briefly. Flare. Oh, that sounds like a party trick. Um, <laughs> okay. Sense summoned, a spell that I thought would be super useful. I never touched in the original game. Um, oh, I sense a summoned creature. It's pounding on my head four inches to the left. <laughs> hmm. I have hmm. all... Uh, yeah, hmm. I think I have all of these already. Oh, here we go. Level six. Oh, wait a minute. No, I don't have that one. Buy. Yes, I want to buy four of that, please. Thank you. Um, effect conjures a dimensional pocket that allows you to carry heavy loads unhindered. The pouch and all of its contents will be lost if you leave the world of Norath for a significant period of time, which is 30 minutes, basically. That's code. Um, oh, yeah. It's, it's little bags. <gasps> I have some. Yes. 
I actually use this dumb spell quite a bit. There's an equivalent that warlocks have in uh, World of Warcraft. I used it there, too. And it's actually useful. You can get it and conjure it and zip it into areas where hostile mobs are. The trick is, is that with World of Warcraft, at least... No, I think it was EverQuest. If you if something aggroed onto your eye, it would then aggro onto you when the eye died. It would pass, yep. pass the aggro on. So I would use it to pull for our group. I would summon an there eye, zip it out there... Get something to aggro on it and whip in. Wait a minute, what point did the... Oh, the wife just cheered for 59 bits. Thank you, honey. That's a weird number. Yeah, eye-pulling, yeah. It sounds painful, but it's actually a thing. <laughs> um, I'm going to pull my eye, what? Okay, uh, there's... Level 7 is Renew Elements. Renews the health of your... Oh, yeah, it is a pet heal. I'm actually going to preemptively buy it. Oh, my God, I can actually watch an ad today. Buy Elemental and Fire. Shield of Fire. I don't really have the space for this, but whatever. And then Shaka Blades. I'm actually not going to buy any more ahead of time because I'm on space. I need more bags. Um, uh, you do get a free backpack at your banker. If you, if you go open up your bank, there is a free backpack in there. <laughs> I went and stole it. Maybe I should go do that. Hang on a sec. It was, I think it's yeah, a uh, eight slot bag, which is perfectly fine. It's eight more slots. <laughs> I may or may not have already. I have a backpack I got from somewhere. I have two of them. Okay. You must uh, earn level seven before you can. Okay, so I have four spells that I need to um, set on. Quiver. I'm just kind of shocked that they let us do. Yeah, your class deity and or race may not equip class one wood point arrow in the arrow slot. Okay. Warrior Paladin, Ranger, Shadow Knight, and Rogue. So these are completely pointless. I mean, they're not pointless. The arrows, they have a point, but you know. They're not... Never mind. Uh, it was a bad joke. Um, let's sell that. Yes. Are you sure you would like to sell this content? It's a quiver. It, I have no use for this thing. Okay. Um, Carol. Uh, do we know what we do with this... Uh, this um, Chunk of bronze. Do you know what purpose it has in here? Uh, you give it to the weapons dude, and he'll give you a new weapon. Weapons dude, all right. Oh, soul binder. <laughs> I forgot about that. Um, weapons. Absor? This guy over here? Yep. Hey, Absor. I have some bronze for you to stick up your butt. Uh, give. And I got another knife exactly like the one I had. Glooming oh, oh, oh. Deep Dagger. Uh, base damage four. Iron Glooming Deep Dagger. Hey, what do you know? Can I, can I do a wield? No. Uh, and oh, oh. you. Oh, wait a minute. This is bronze. Oh, this, I, I got an upgraded one at some point. Nice. Yep. I'm going to give a dagger to Larrera. Let's see what he does with it. Um. Okay, Alt Q. The Revolt of Glooming Deep. So I'm at the same step you are now. Speak to okay. Revolt Scout Z Zajir. 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 And finish this quest, Scouting Glooming Deep. Okay, so I'm on the same step you are. I have the snappy okay. robes. Is there a way to not make the hat thing render? Uh, it's an options, which is all L. Um, destroy. I don't want the dumb bronze dagger. Um, alt O. Nope. Uh, wait a minute. Was that it? Yeah, that was it. Okay. Um, display and then show my helm. Show pre. Oh, oh, oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Show pre Luckland models. Okay. Switch up current. Uh, set the current window to full screen. I'm worried that this is going to blink out my stream, but I don't think they actually have. 
Um, There's no window borderless. I'm playing it full screen right now. Oh, overlap Windows taskbar. Is that a thing? No, it's not a thing. It did nothing. Yay! Okay. Um... By bit ad finally, says here, Donnie. Uh, backpacks are finally. uncommon loot from barrels. Awesome. Okay. So, is there a bank person here that you 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 said there was a bank person? Yeah, here? it's the uh, frog lock. Lindro. It's the who? It's the frog lock. Oh yeah. Okay. Hello, Mister Banker person. There is another bag in here. <gasps> and if I remember right, coin would stay on your body if you died, right? It should. It's also weightless, thank God. Yeah, it's weightless now. I would like to point that out. Now it wasn't weightless, weightless before. <laughs> Some people had to suffer through coin having weight. That sucked. I cannot stress that enough. And it also did uh, not auto up convert. You had to do that at banks by hand. Yeah, by hand. Bank, so you yeah. had to actually change between copper to silver to gold. So there was a point where somebody did a trade with me and they paid for it in like fifteen thousand copper. <laughs> I literally couldn't move. I was like, you son of a... Oh, God. How dare you? How dare you? Okay, um, um, I'm actually gonna... Gonna drop... I don't know. I'm gonna get two of my platinum. I don't want to roll around with no cash, but... I am gonna get two of my platinum. What am I? Auto bank and shroud bank. What's auto bank? What? Click the button uh, with an item on your cursor. Oh, Okay. And it'll automatically bank at any time you... Hey, that's nice. That's a good feature. Okay. Drop coins. Wait a minute. What? Here. Or click to pick up platinum. So you can... Yeah, see? You can dump your change and turn it into platinum or whatever. Anyway. Yep. Done. Um, I'm so done. Um... Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's do... Actually, make some sense out of this nonsense. Is there a thing that causes the bags to auto open when you open your inventory? I'm not sure, but the command to open up all your bags at once is uh, Shift B. <gasps> okay, awesome. Thank you. Um, that that solves that problem. That command is helpful when your like, character mm -hmm. has got literally twelve bags. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Spells. There's just a dude named. I mean, that does... What, 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 um, you hail him and he'll, get, and he'll cast a spell on you, I think. Oh. Blessed? Or perhaps like to review my lessons from earlier? Oh, just bless me. Bless me! I mean, uh, what? What? <laughs> yeah, what? Okay, so real quick... I'm going to do I want to recast my lesser shilling. I'm confused. Okay, I'm going to do it the way you taught me how to do it. I'm going to right click on the slot and do create item utility dimensional pocket. And you wait. Then you wait. Ding. Now I have to come down, come off cooldown. I'm going to do clearing the blinkers. There we go. I can now click that. Summon a bag. I don't know if I can I trade these things to you or not? Um, I'm not sure. Are they no trade? Uh, it's four slots. It'll no tell point. you. No point. It, it's so cute. <laughs> four slot, but it's weightless. So anything you put in there is completely weightless. Size cap, giant. Um, small. It does not say no trade. I wonder, it uh -huh. used to be... Hang on a sec. Uh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Right here. Oh. oh, yes, you're directly behind me. How stupid of me. Um, <laughs> I'm going to try and see your spell physics. Frizzle. How'd you... I'm going to try and see if I cast it on you. It used to be that I had to cast things and then summon them and then trade them. But then they made it to where if you summoned it, and you had somebody as a target, it would summon in their inventory. Did you get a bag? Nope. Okay, let me see real quick. Oh, it's on my it's on my cursor. Trade. Trade. 
Woo! Cool, they are actually no try that. Uh, oh. pit of boss, awesome. Dimensional okay, pot. you can only have one at a time, but still. Okay, and then we go to... I have the healing elemental water now. Um, I'm, okay, I think I'm good. So now right. we, we need to go to Revolt of Glooming. I'm going to stick with the tank. We're two robe wearers. I'm going to stick with the tank pet for now. Yeah. Um, um, and I've got a healer cleric, a, a mercenary that seems to do it okay. So. Yes, <laughs> yes. Your mercenary is not an idiot. I had to dismiss mine. No, no, no. You're too stupid for us. You, you just go stay in the corner. <laughs> Um, um Scout Zajir. We have two steps for Scout Zajir. Um, do we know uh, where Alt that? F, Control F. I Wait a minute, what? Find. Not map. Uh, control. Yeah, find window. Don't show raid. Are they farther in? I'm assuming so. Okay, well let's let's motor up this way. It's a cave bat. Um, Kuga says I started as a monk and had to have friends carry my money for me. And please, for the love of God, turn off auto loot. Yeah, exactly. Monks still have the weight penalty, which I think is dumb. Uh, I mean, from an ARP, an absolutely super hyper realistic RP sense, it makes it. Yeah, I get it. But but from an let's actually have people play a class and have fun sense, no. No, 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 no. Do, 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 do. A glooming deep slave warden's corpse. Uh, chunk of bronze. Haha, <laughs> I'm not falling for that trick again. Screw you. <laughs> Actually, no, I will take it so I can give my pet a weapon. <laughs> I tried to give a uh, one of those daggers to Lorar and he gave it back. Huh. Yeah, it was a bronze dagger, glooming deep, a bronze glooming deep dagger, and yeah. Also, glooming deep, gloom deep would glooming be deep. way easier to say. B uh, clunk. We got a bar somewhere. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. Symbols uh, oh, court. You. A goblin say. Oh, here we go. Hail. Yeah. Hail, yes. Okay, scouting glooming deep. The revolt is pinned down, defending disposition. We needs ya to explore the rest of the mines. And, oh, God, I'm getting dumb just reading this. <laughs> and sees where the kobolds have dug in so as we can plan. Wow, plan our counterattack. Here are some directions. Ooh, that's rough. Um, Oof. And then what? We hailed them again, and there's sabotage. The kobolds are foolish enough... To, yes, I'm translating. Foolish enough to teach us to make blasting power for opening the new mine tunnels. Here, take this makeshift lantern bomb and place it in the kobold siege supplies. Supplies are in a giant crate just out of Port Glooming Deep. Okay. Okay, I took the other dude's uh, quest. Yeah. Oh, God, I have a, I have a bomb. Um, What other dude's quest? What? A bomb. Oh, this oh, guy? Oh, oh, left, yep. Kai Chick Kai Kitch. Welcome to EverQuest, where we meet all of our NPC names with a Scrabble set. <laughs> oh, hold on. One of the lights in our room just died. It's got real dark in here. <laughs> <laughs> Did you lose power? No, one of the lights in my room just died. Oh, the bulb died in there or something, huh? Yep. Sorry, I'm eating the last of my sandwich. It's tacky to eat on stream, but I'm Sandwich. Hungry. That's why I ate the bagel before I logged into Discord. <laughs> oh. Yeah, there's a bard behind us. A cat person bard. Uh, I, I have this thing. If you don't know... I'll tell you what, just for festivity, let's change it to a bigger vision. Old <laughs> games in black and white. Woohoo! Um, I had this thing a long time ago, way back in 2006, where my stomach exploded and tried to take the rest of me with it. Um, I got a hole 
It was due to acid reflux and bad eating and all sorts of stuff. Bad diet. I had uh, uh, acid reflux literally ate a hole in the top of my stomach right where it connects with the um, uh, bu- 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 your, your esophagus. Like the opening to the stomach. I have scar tissue there now and it's messed up the muscle structure there. So periodically that will clamp shut and it does not want to open. So if I eat stuff too quickly, especially if it's dry stuff or bready stuff, if I eat it too quickly, I will literally choke on it. Like it'll just back up in my throat and I can't do anything about it. It's a bummer of a thing. But basically it's just taught me to, well, just chew slow and enjoy your damn food. So (laughs) thank you, Dragon Racer. My mods are always on point. I'm spoiled with the number of mods I have and how good they are. Um, hello, Tiger Man. Please do not do anything to my rock pet. Um, okay. Yeah. There's a giant body of water that I'm ominous to swim into, but we probably could. Um, okay. The, the bulb is not dead for some reason. I guess not all the contact is making because now it's blinking at me. <laughs> One second. I'm going to get epilepsy. Yeah, I, you, you, you go fix that real quick. That sounds annoying as piss. I'm going to kill a barrel real quick. More arrows. Pass. Are you, you're a different kind of barrel. Will you have anything in, in, interesting? More arrows. Nah. Okay. We can go back to color vision. It's probably boring to watch. Especially since it's EverQuest. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Hang on a sec. While Eridani is messing with his bulbs, let's go to twitch.tv. Let's go to the front page. Uh, browse. And then search for EverQuest. I am always curious when I do old games like this. Okay, EverQuest 1. I am not the only person streaming. Mm, four viewers, seven viewers, eight viewers, eight viewers, eight viewers. And then there's Sussy Poo, who is 39 viewers. Woo. Okay, somebody's been doing this for a while. I'm always curious to see what kind of views and how many streams there are going on for these older games when I mess with them. Um, I have returned. You were spinning around in circles. I figured it was either that or you were having a fit. Um, <laughs> okay. All right. Boing. We have four quests here. Um. Uh, okay, I have Goblin Treachery, Sabotage, Scouting Glooming Deep, and then I have the overall Revolt of Glooming Deep thing. Oh, my. Is that what you have? Oh, uh, I also have Busted Locks. Busted lock. Where'd you get that? Uh, from, uh, Kai, 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 Oh, Busted Locks. Yeah, okay. I must have totally missed this one. Okay, so I have busted locks also. Four quests. Roger, roger. Roger, roger. Uh, let's see. Infiltrate Glooming Deep Jail. Find the locksmith's master key. Deliver the key back to Kaikich. Then the goblin treachery is kill ten goblins. We'll probably be doing that going through the de- the jail, right? Yeah. Sabotage is make, set the makeshift lantern bomb in the cobalt supply crate, which is probably going to be somewhere out front of Fort Glooming Deep, they said? Probably. Go east down this tunnel until you get to dig site two. Oh, God. <laughs> Head south until you spies the main pit. Dig site one. Um, can you feel your IQ dropping, ladies and gentlemen? Follow, yep. <laughs> follow the eastern wall along the rim of the pit. Then enter den. D-E-N. <sighs> then enter the <laughs> next tunnel. Yeah, something. Next tunnel you cross. Oh my god, this is cryptic. Okay. Let's work on the okay. first three. Busted locks and goblins and exploding things. Okay. Uh, thankfully, the map does label each area. So, oh, S- we just pulled something. Goblin slave. Where did my... My pet just ran off to you. Oh, hey, you. Goblin slave is up here. Yeah, my pet is not... I must have closed my pet window or something. Or was it Alt-P? Nope, that's... Oh, that's group. I need that. 
Uh, pet window is uh, all F1. Okay. It's dead. You got nothing. Somehow. Your faction standing with Kill Bullets of Gloomy Deep has been adjusted by negative one. Oh, oh no. Oh god. <laughs> Not my faction standing. Gloomy Deep Slave Warden. Sikkim Whoa, he's yellow. I'm gonna back up. <laughs> Whoosh! Nope, nope, I'll stay over here. I will fireball this guy from safety. Oh, Lorar is holding up okay. Yeah, I don't know if your, your mercenary was healing him or what, but... Oh, what the heck? I got some gold. That's dope. I received yeah. five, seven silver and four copper for split. He had money. Goblin whip. Inter I mean, kobold whip. Interesting. Um, it's funny. There used to be, oh gosh, what was it called? Something burrow. No, not, yeah. Black burrow? No, no, no. Okay, in old EQ, this is old EQ. In this game, outside of Quainos, there was... Western Karana and then Eastern Karana and they both connected to Southern Karana. You remember that? Yep. Okay. In Southern Karana, there was a Cobalt Burrow dungeon and there were specific dun specific Cobalts in the bottom that had rare drops of these stun whips. That's right. Yeah, okay. This was back when pets could actually uh, hold weapons like skeletal pets and uh, uh elemental pets and stuff, so I would summon stabs or daggers for my wep my pets to use, and I would give them to... Ne Necromancers were always bugging me for pet weapons. So, yep. uh, I went and got a stack of those... Like, stack. I got, like, five or six of those stun whips, and my air elemental could dual-wield them. And it would proc them extremely high, because it had a really high dexterity. Yep. Plus, plus, it procs an air elemental ability that does stun anyway, so I just had this stun, stun, stun air pet. It was nuts. It was like my secret weapon for boss fights, and it was freaking epic. But then they said, oh, no, pets cannot equip weapons anymore. And, and I just had five of those things lying around I couldn't do anything with. So anyway, that's my story. Um, Let's see. So we need to go. Let's see. Busted locks. Uh, most of the slaves who went back to these caverns are still bound in chains. Our blades are dull from breaking all the cobalt bonds. We need you to find a cobalt locksmith and steal his key ring. Okay. Is it this way? Uh, I think so, yeah. Hold on. Pull my map back up. Oh, God. There's a map. I forgot. Yep. Let's make this thing bigger. Holy. Holy crap, holy. Um... Slave Revolt Camp, that's where we started. And then we do 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 up here. We're now looking at oh okay, so dig site two is east, dig site one is south of that. Yep. And then Fort it's Blooming Deep hit. is east of that. So I think actually we need um, to go, the think, Busted Locks has us go up to the Glooming Deep Jail, which is north of us. Okay, so let's do that first. We go north first, uh, and then the other the other quests are gonna be east and southeast. Yep. Um Sikkim, Larar. Yep, root him in place and go beat him. Well, bam. Cast stage complete. Infiltrate the gloomy deep jail. I'm tempted to try the fire pet since we have your healer. Yeah. To see how much extra damage we'd get or the air pet. But the air pet really only excels if it's behind the target and something else is taunting, then it does extra backstab damage. Or at least, that's yeah. how it used to be. It's 3 o'clock on a Thursday afternoon. I'm playing EverQuest 1. It's really, really freaking weird. <laughs> I have to check, like, what year is it? What year is this? <laughs> oh, never mind. It's what dead. year is it? I'm going to loot it. Ooh. All right, we see a five silver. Crude Warhammer. 
Ooh. Wait, 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 wait. Class Mage. What? Ooh. Base damage four. Um, loot? Yes. Can I, can I really? Oh, I'm Warhammer. You guys, I'm Warhammer. Okay, that's super dope. I have a hammer that I can hit things with. It does technically one point less damage than the dagger I just put away, but that's not the point. It's a hammer. Yeah. Um, Slave Warden. Let's go over here. Thwack. Yeah, Tucker too far, get closer. I'm going to turn my melee off. I look awesome holding a hammer, though. It's hammer time, says Kugus. Time to ban the mods, mobs, oh. says Dragon Razor. So do you charge up there to get it to smack you once so you can activate your pet? Is that what you're doing? A pet and also get, uh, get experience. Uh, that's a good point. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm fireballing it, so that's that's... As long as I hit it once, I get experience. Yeah. Uh oh, Larar is dead. Oh. Um, let's Pat? do Alt Seven. Oh, I got stung. Okay. Casting a root. Second. Rooted. Second. Come on, the barn. Oh, you're just, you're just a jerk. Oh, I thought a lie that the, your pet died. My he was in a mana. There Woo. we go. Oh, your pet, your mercenary actually sat down. I think to regain mana. Yeah, she's out. Um. Anything interesting? An iron ore. An iron ore and another whip. Got one gold. Where I, where's the sit button? There's the sit button. Um, let's open up. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot something. Let's do create item. Focus. Summon brass choker. Ooh. Um, I can't remember when you summon a pet, do you use an item? Uh, if I do? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, hang on a sec. I use a tiny dagger. Tiny daggers, pretty ribbons are blue. <laughs> uh, I don't know why I do that. Uh -huh. There we go. I can now forget that. Forget that. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to make sure. Okay, that's burn. Oh yeah, flame bolt. Ooh. Let's see. Direct damage, fire. Level five. Let's put that there. Add. Strengthen and haze. Oh. Stand set. I have a nine. I have stuff already on my bar that I'm not even looking at. Spells. <laughs> okay, there we go. I have a, in theory... Oh, no, wait, no, that's wrong. Um, burns your target skin with a bolt of fire causing between 45 and 55 damage. Okay. It's longer casting time, but it hits a hell of a lot harder. Yep, okay. Awesome, so in theory I have a harder hitting spell now. 
Um, oh, and I'm still kind of low on mana. I think your mercenary's back up, though. Yep. A faster mana regen than I do. I mean, holy crap. <laughs> well, I, my theory is a smaller mana pool. Or well, that, too. Yeah, yeah, Bum, 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 bum. Okay, I'm at about 82%. Give me just a, a, a few seconds more and we can get topped back up. These things are a little bit higher level than us, so I think like one level higher. But it's just uh, enough. One or to, two. They're yeah. conning yellow, so one or two. Yeah, so they're, they're, it's, they're slightly beefier, and I can kind of feel it in the fights. Well, yeah, your tank fight actually died. <laughs> yes, it got pummeled. I mean, even, Oh, they're level seven. That's actually kind of cool. They actually, they actually tell you the level now. Oh, my meditate skill's going up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I forgot about that. The higher the meditate skill, the faster you recover mana. That's dope. I, yep. I think more more games should have stuff like that. Okay. I am ready. Oh, I'm ready to go. I've got 76% mana. That should be enough. Yeah. Okay. We got a numb skull down here. You up? Uh, nope. There's one right next to me, and he smacked me. Well, let's do this, and let's try flame bolt. And people, the thing I got that tash off. He has lower magic resist. Oh, that's taking chunks off. Let's throw this. There you go. Eat fire, sucker. Yeah, I, your mercenary is healing my pet a lot. So I think that's why the last one died, is because uh, uh, your mercenary was out of ammo, basically. Mana, yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's yeah. the locksmith that we're looking for. Crap. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Can I? I want to risk it, because if we pull two, I don't think it's going to go all that well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does make me wonder if I should go back and get another mercenary. Get, like, a second healer. Yeah, get a, a second healer. That would actually be a good idea. You want to backtrack and do that? Oh, there's a dude behind us real quick. Let's go. No. Hey. Here we go. Sick him. Let's wow. clear this guy. Tash. Ow! Oh what is crap! Going on. Pull the second mob. Uh oh. Okay. Room, room. Oh, I'm stunned. Okay, that one's dead. Okay, see if you can back up a step. Yep. I'm not stunned anymore. Um, gosh, my tank, my, my pet was tanking it, thankfully. Um, there we go. There we go. You loot one, I <laughs> loot one. Loot all. More Warhammers. Okay, great. That's let's, okay. We can stall for money. Let's backtrack. Oh, uh, there's a goblin money. slave. Is that hostile? Um... I don't care. Humble boy. I'm, I'm gonna kill it. All right. Uh, after that, I can cast an invis on all of us, unless you have invis. Do I have invis? Ah, <laughs> no. Uh, no. That, uh, May just got that closer to like level twenty or something. Oh, yeah, I got level four apparently. Yeah, illusions got way earlier than nobody else. Yeah, perfect. The barn. He's taking the aggro. So I can smack this thing with a hammer and get my skill up some. Yeah, that's why I'm, I tend to walk up and hit him. So I'm getting my one hand blood and offense skills up. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, cast in. Okay, just target myself. It, no, don't target myself. <laughs> what happens if I give him a hammer? <gasps> oh my god. Did it actually work? 
Oh, okay, it's you dope. are. You're invised. I am. I'm a cast on my. Yep. Eh, I don't mana. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Let's just fight I'm through. Wrestling. I swear. Uh, we're pretty close. I think this is the way to go, right? Uh, turn right. E yep, turn right. Real. Blooming Deep Warrior. Let's get that offense skill up. Come on. Yep. Dude. I think the hammers help. Probably. Mm. Wait a minute. Task stage complete. Oh, we killed enough of the goblin. I mean, uh, the uh, kobold guys. Are we going the right way? No, it's right? because we're moving through the dig site areas for that uh, one uh, scouting task. Oh, yeah, the scouting task. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Do you want to fight him? It might as well. He's, he's in the way. Uh, okay. Let's do that. Can I? I mean, I'm not in combat. Yeah, my meditate's going up. Hooray! Yep. Which means I can do this. I'm completely out of mana. <laughs> awesome! Fireball! Four silver and ten copper. Yep. It's nice. We're actually getting money for doing this. I know, right? Eraser's uh, his his meditation impersonation. Oh, um, 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 resistance, amperes. That's an electrician joke. Um, <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Yep, we go back here. Let's see if I can get a um, a mercenary. Illogist. I'm gonna sell some crap. Oh, Merc Liaison. Right. Right. Okay. You. Tier 1. You're looking for the one that has uh, balanced and passive. Human. Okay, yeah, there's a human tank and then a human... Wait a minute. Apprentice and Journeyman. Oh, I don't have that. No, no, no. So there's one that's got a healer. Yep. Can I get the higher tier ones? Oh, uh, no. Tier oh. one's only for non-paying people. <laughs> oh, really? Yep. Okay, so confidence low. Oh, that's joy. Um, healer type. Higher, please. There we go. Durante! Durantus! I'm gonna sit. We can get our mana back real quick. I probably should sell oh, some. I can! What? I gave the cobalt, one of my cobalt whip I picked up for my pet. Oh, you gave it a whip? Dude, it's dual wielding. It's got a whip and a hammer. <laughs> That's cheating. <laughs> cheating. Okay. Cheater. Okay. We've got two healers now. Two backup healers. That should help. And we've got my... My pet for tank, yours, which I think we're going to have to stick with, and yours for DPS. Basically. Yeah. Doing back fighter. Damn, I haven't played EQ in forever. Hey, doing back. What's going on? Oh, tier one and two are for free players, says says Kugas. Oh. Oh, did they actually add tier two for free? Uh, back when I last played, it was only tier one. Well, I mean, there's, there's the type, apprentice, and journeyman. If I go to journeyman, it specifically says tier one all access, but I think it's... Oh, gotcha. I don't think I can mess with that. There's Apprentice, and then there's Tier 1 and Tier 2. There's Tier 3. I don't I don't know why I couldn't get a Tier 3. Okay, I get it. They, they've changed a little bit, I guess. Um, See, there's Purchase. Not, I, it's been so long since I've played this. Um, purchase cost and upkeep cost are all blanked. 
uh, we don't get we don't get hit with purchase costs until I think level ten. Basically, you have the, the maximum tier, number of mercenaries. You, are... you must dismiss one. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna dismiss um, a mercenary. You have recently dismissed a mercenary. Must wait a few more seconds before you can purchase a new one. Okay, I'm just gonna try and see if I can get a tier five healer. Yeah. Um, I'm assuming that the main difference will be stats, ability. Um, one goal per 15 minutes at level 15. Okay. Thanks, Gugus. Um, so yeah, I do, actually, I do remember there uh, being, my parents have gotten uh, journeyman marks and they cost, okay, a couple plat every 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you guys like my skull head. What? What are you talking about? Dismiss. Yes. Okay, I have a tier 5 healer. Pro Ronnie. Great name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's shuffle things around a little bit here. Let's wait a few more seconds before you can purchase a new one. Yeah, it took, it was about a minute cooldown or whatever for me. Oh, actually, I'll tell you what I'll do. Yep, I'll put it up there, there and I can minimize Ooh. it. Nope, it's better up here. Yep, okay, awesome. That way I can kind of forget about him. Um, I'm full on... Uh, uh, no. Um, mana? I'm about to fix that. Okay. Just recover a bit more. Paul, hey, what's going on? I am Izzy Flip. I was checking on something. What? Izzy Flip. Who's is is Izzy Flip somebody here? Slash who? <laughs> We're on the Vox server. I don't know if that matters. Amazed how poorly this iMac handles an EQ1. Oh, it's funny. EQ always really badly optimized for its time, unfortunately. Yes, I agree, Duneback. Way back in the day, it was badly optimized. Now, it's badly optimized, but it uses far less resources than compared to current games. Um, EQ, uh, yeah, Paul Hayes says, not much. I don't think I have EQ1, but I have played EQ2. I played EQ2 as well. I want to log back into that and see if they've improved it at all, because it is free-to-play as well, and it's a more up-to-date game. Um, they handled the free-to-play transition very badly in that game, and it kind of pissed me off. But um, uh, EQ1 is free to play. You could have it if you want to. You might be crazy. And you've you know. got 21 expansions worth of free content. Mm-hmm. Lots 21. of stuff. Lots of stuff to do. Okay. I think I am as ready as I'm going to be. Oh, I basically met it up, so yeah, I'm good to go. Um, oh, I'll tell you what, real quick. Since we're here, I'm just going to go. This Octopaw guy is still AFK. Um, I'm going to go over here real quick and sell. Oh yeah, I just oh, I got a couple gold out of up ahead. Okay, awesome. Yeah. So now we never get back. I'm gonna follow you. All right, yeah. Mr. Mason Whip Pet. <laughs> you wanna hear the duel? It's freaking cheating. I mean, I could sure. summon. I could summon it a pair of daggers that it could do. I think. But, oh know. boy. Oh, wait a minute. Time. Time left 11 minutes 24 seconds on my tier 5. So I guess the trade out, they don't tell you this, the trade out is the higher tier ones don't last as long. Um, No, uh, every mercenary resets every, every 15 minutes. Oh. The difference is uh, upkeep cost. Ooh. 
So these have no upkeep cost. Uh, yeah, all mercs have no upkeep until level 15. That's what it was. I would like to state. Ah. I would like to state for the record that this is. Uh... Got macked by something. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's it is. My pet is beating a crap out of me. Um. Oh, it's dead. Yeah. Woo. I tell you what, when you get another whip, give it to my uh, earth pet, please. Oh. Actually, I'm gonna. Oh, Go he, did... he didn't have any weapons on him. Um. Uh. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hello, slave. Uh, kind of annoyed. The two limit. The two limit characters per server. I have tunes on a few servers, trying different things out. See, I'm a previous paying players. I've got four slots. Uh, well, I mean, are you a PV previous paying as in you paid when the game was not free to play or when it was free to play? Yes. You paid? So I grandfathered in under silver. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm silver also. Does that mean I have two? I mean, four. You, oh. you should have four slots, yeah. Yeah, so, okay, I'm, an, I'm a silver player. Awesome. That's cool. I didn't know I got a perk from that. Um, for a while there, when it was first free to play, you could actually buy silver tier. For, I think it was I think it was five dollars, but when SOE sold the game, well, when SOE became Daybreak essentially, yeah, yeah, um, they did away with the silver. But anybody who had silver kept it, thankfully. Vox, I have a fifteenth level Necro and a level seven Shadow Knight. Should try to remember my ancient login details. <laughs> How much space does it take? A lot. Uh, next gap we have, I can actually try. I'm trying to save mana by smacking this guy, but it's not helping. Exactly, because my my dot well it does quite a bit of damage. It eats through my mana. Die already, please. Does this guy have? A, I'm gonna see if he's got a whip. Cobalt whip, hey, awesome. Nice. So I'm gonna get this, and I'm gonna see what happens. <laughs> I don't know if it makes a difference, but it looks awesome. Um, okay, the... Uh, oh, is he actually dual building? That's awesome. Where's your mercenary? My merc is uh, in the very back. <laughs> okay. Hiding around the corner. Mine's sitting down. I'm assuming that means it's low on mana, so... They're about... About 70-ish. 70 70%-ish. Uh, 70 how do you tell? I'm looking down at the uh, uh, group window. It's kind of it's really hard to see, but there's actually a tiny blue. There's a tiny line underneath. Oh, the, the line underneath line. him. Oh, the oh the mercenary show up in the group window. I didn't even look at it. That's yes, awesome. they okay. actually count as people in a group. So if you've got uh, like, two people with a bunch of mercenaries, I would. Th I think <laughs> technically speaking, counting the fact that the pets actually are very very capable. I think that it's interesting that we're two people that actually have a party of, like, six? I mean, really, when it comes down to it? Yeah, each got two... I'm actually totally okay with them using, with the mercs using group slots, because it prevents you yeah. from having five people with five mercs having a small raid group. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we ready to push forward? Yep. Are we just going to kill on our way, or are we going to try to avoid stuff? Oh, if we get a, if they're way out of the way, let's not worry about it. But if they're in our way, kill them. There is a dude the here. Albino I, dude. I think oh. white one's coming up forward. But we've got a pair here. No. Okay. Do you want me to zap him or what? Uh. Screw it. What's the worst that happens? Okay, awesome. Okay, did aggro the warrior. I'll stand back and make sure this warrior is not aggro. If he does, I'll mess him. Oh, well, okay, he did it, actually. I'm kind of surprised. Hey, it's a ban. Attack. Trying to get out of him. Uh-oh. There we go. Oh, got whacked. And you're, you're there's one behind you. Oh. Hello there. I'm gonna root him. Oh. Uh, enfeeblement. 
Uh, okay, the locksmith's almost dead. Locksmith's right, dead. Crap out of this one. There goes the barn. Sick him, boy. Player should keep it up, thankfully. Uh, we let him get their mana back. I think we were pushing too fast. You're almost dead, man. Just do, just give up. There we go. Let's go. <laughs> okay, I think we both have to loot the locksmith. I think. Do we have to um, get... I think one should, but when we take it back, it should count for both of us. It should. Yeah, it's still got the corpse. See, there is a glooming deep master key for me as well. Okay. And, and kobold parts. Gross. <laughs> um. Okay, so yeah, we both have that quest item. Um, we have a slave warden coming up behind us. Fast walk. Uh, too late. Get him. Almost exploded. Um. <laughs> this flame bolt takes a lot of mana, but it really it, yeah. hurts. Actually, it doesn't take a lot of mana. Oh yeah, never mind. It does. Take about ten percent. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I need to cast my lesser shielding again. My buff just ran out. And Kuga boy. says, not sure what raid I would want to try with mostly mercs. What's the worst that can happen I'm for the, the starting game? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You loot that one. Do we want to backtrack and turn this in real quick or what? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Cool. Three silver, eight copper. So we got Go busted locks. In. We need to kill more goblin slaves in those entry areas. Apparently, yeah. Uh, uh, you missed. You missed a turn, I missed dude. The corner. Yeah. Yep. I All think right. we're gonna have to fight this guy. So, Hold on. Uh, Let me see if I can't. Never mind. Get him. <laughs> he aggroed on me. Let's see if I can. And I couldn't mess and then run by him. But oh well. Yeah, I got too close. Sorry. Did you hit me one time? So the bomb walks in. They have no pet commands. So I'm on a mage. I can get pet commands. I have to, uh, yeah. Well, uh, enchanters don't get actual pet commands until you mm -hmm. actually uh, put AAs in. Yeah. Which I get, because they're, they're, they're not a pet focused class, so I don't mind. But times like this, where it's like, hey, you, get off your butt and go over there and hit something. Okay. Get a move on. There's symbols, corpse, which I think means this is the room we need to go to. Um, busted lock is Kai Kachi. Yep. So we bring this up, grab this. Please have a key, Mr. Troll. I just leveled up, I think. Oh, seven. Hey, select nice. option, some gloves. Super nice. Okay. I did not actually get the quest completion. You didn't? I did, did not. you get the key? New. No. Oh crap! Hang on a uh, sec. The, when you pick up the key, um. Okay, I'm gonna memorize some spells real quick yeah, and let our mercenaries recover some energy. Draw a bit low on mana. Um, I can't remember how to actually. I'm nearly level seven. How to memorize a spell. Is it left click? Uh, if you just right click the scroll, it should auto mem it. No, I mean, I'm sorry. Putting a spell into your spell book. I mean, not into spell book, but into your, yeah, into your casting bar. Oh, never mind. I figured it out. Okay, yeah. You left click on it and it does it. Uh, interesting. Um, I have a pet heal now. Nice. Elementaling fire. I have a, an upgraded fire elemental now. At level seven, I will get a. Uh... Surround your target and shield the fire oh. damaging creatures. Oh yes. yes, yes, yes. Love, and, but yeah, at level seven, I'll get a new version of my, of my pet. Awesome. I'm going to change this. I'm going to put flame bolt there. There we go. Memorizing flame bolt done. 
And then I'm gonna do... Memorizing Shield of Fire. Fire! Ah ha, I want you to burn. Ah ha. It's a song from like the 70s or something. Um, <laughs> Shock of Blades. I cannot remember what this one was. Um, Conjures a Shock of Blades that assaults your target, causing... 37 to 42 damage. Okay. Right. Um, I have that. Now I have... Dun, dun, dun. I'm super ready. All righty. I think our mercenaries are ready. Let's go back and kick some locksmith ass. I'm going to try to get better about avoiding some of these dumbasses. There's one here, though. I want to actually kill this guy. Because we, we having so many around, we got ambushed in the middle of the attack last time. Yeah. And I'm going to do this and this. Oh, wrong button. Yep, shield of fire. There we go. Fire. And I can do. Fire. Fizzle. Oh, that messed oh, him up. Man. Okay. Woo! I'm gonna. Let's see. So I actually have a pet heal now. Awesome. Um, um, I can also put... What happened? Pet. What? Your pet died, right? Oh, I just missed it. I, got, oh. I hit level 7. New pet. I was, I was like, oh, what happened? I killed him. Okay, slave Animation. guy is coming in. Oh, he stopped. Okay. Oh, perfect. Back way this way. There is a dude that will uh, pop pop in behind you, temper possibly. So I wouldn't back up too far. Too far, yeah. Far enough so I can cast a couple spells and put a new pet. <laughs> okay, so I have a pet right. heal. I have fire shield, which I can put on him, which means that he does damage to anybody that is attacking him. I see. No, that's just a slave warden. Never mind. We need the albino one, right? Yep. Crude hammer. Awesome. You can give it to your pet. Yep. Bam. Okay. Oh, that new pet took a lot of energy out of me. Let's do... Oh, that was wrong. Or I need to shuffle these around. I think. Okay. Yay! A chunk of iron. So many cobalt whips. I don't need to face that way. I need to, oh, here's the symbol bard guy. And he's fighting a slave warden. Okay. Need any cobalt whips? I got some cobalt whips. <laughs> <laughs> like, like five of them and you go sell them again. <laughs> All right, let's move forward. Let's see if I can't find this. Albino dude. There are wanderers that go along this path that we need to be careful about. Oh, uh, wait a yep, minute. There's one. Also, our our mercenaries keep sitting down. They're falling, man. I think they're just sitting. 
Let's do this guy and do horn. Cash. Yeah, hit me. Come on, hit me. Thank you. Oh, my pet will actually whack him. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna sit down. I stand up if my pet needs like I can do. My spell does not fizzle. Oh my god. Stop fizzling! Another whip! Alright, he's not here yet. Oh, name mob. Do you think he spawns at the door or what? Probably. Okay. We have um, to actually want to. Maybe maybe he, he may spawn closer up here, I'm not sure. I see an albino kobold man. That's so much to ask. Okay, I think right about here. I don't right know. About I'm gonna here. I'm gonna park. Yep. <laughs> Thanks, small rat. This only happens to all gnomes at one point in their life. No, oh, stop. <laughs> I, I wish there was a way that I could have a spell automatically target a specific target. You know, like do a macro thing. Yeah. Or you could do target pet and then cast spell and then switch back to hostile or whatever. I don't know. That'd be nice. How's your Thursday going, Mall Rat? What's happening? Mr. Mall Rat's been working on a secret project for me. Secret. Secret project. Yes. Symbol begins to spam chat with this song. Something, something, <laughs> something. Okay, do I still have center blessing of... Oh, I don't. What the heck happened? Hang on a second. Oh, uh, cool. Because level 7, they have a new uh, buff. Now, center instead of curve. Oh, cool. Okay. It's dope. Wait a minute. What does center do? Oh, uh, it's the same thing as courage, just more stats, uh, which increased your Focus hit point and armor class. Yep. There we go. Yeah, hit point and armor class. Speaking of hit point and armor class, I it's about time to recast Lesser Shield. Um Surrounds target and shield of fire, damaging any okay, what's the duration on this thing? Three minutes and six seconds. Mm, okay. So I don't have to cast it every fight. That's good. Oh, Cobalt, where are you? I know, right? I've got better channeling. I remember way back in the day, uh, named mobs were on a fixed 30-minute time spawn, spawn yep. timer. And, uh, oh, wait a minute. I see him. See oh. him. Get him. Run for him. <laughs> I can imagine him just standing there like, what is this hell of people can put it down the hallway? <laughs> what the hell do I do? <laughs> Oh, I do. Shield of fire on him. Go back to him. Oh, this is why Tab was invented. I get it now. <laughs> oh, I get it now. Oh, he resisted enfeeblement. How dare they? Be enfeebled. Thank you. My pet. Hey, pet. You gotta move on. There we go. Okay, I'm damage. trying to play it a bit more pet. Oh, God. Yep, okay. I knew it. Oh, pulling the one. Hey, you. Oh, I'll attack back Okay, on. locksmith's dead. I've got... Got the uh, earthy... Rooted. Elemental on... Dash. I'm gonna make things even okay. worse. Feeble mint. There we go. I'm gonna back up. Awesome.
There we go. Yeah. Our uh, mercenaries are still really good on mana. They're like, I don't know, I'd say 80% or something? Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, I think what it is, too, is that they got a new healing spell as they leveled up, too. So yeah. when they heal, they heal better for the, about the same amount of mana. Well, okay, these are actually also tier 5s and not tier 1s. True. I see. Oh, crap. I'm going to kill him. I, I, oh, crap. Nope, nope, nope. I got smacked. Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make sure this is on there. I think there's one attacking our. I have a key. Thank you. Task stage completed. See, I should have kept that AOE thing. I do not have it on the bar right now. Gotta load some healing up for the pet. Oh, never mind. Somebody beat me to it. Thank you, healers. Yeah, they're actually doing pretty good on mana. That's damn the ass. These tier fives are nice, man. Okay, cash. And... And Fatalman. Here we go. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Perfect time for that attack to get off because you hit with, the, with your nuke. There we go. Okay. I, there's a lot about the interface that I'm still getting used to, but I actually like the extended targets window, the group window. I can. That I have, was a beautiful invention, that yeah. extended target window. Um, And as you get. And you can put AAs into it and make the target list even longer. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay. We can have back. I can turn this key in. I can go sell some crap because, jeez. So many whips. You can just go to Whoopsie. Sleep. Plague Bearer. Oh, Plague Bearer. Yep, Plague Bearer. Haven't seen one of you in a while. Shield of Fire is still on. Let's go to the barn. Let's do a little Shh. bit of this. Anything. I'm gonna root him. Root him. Wow, that took a lot of hit the last off. <laughs> what do you get? Ooh, he has a staff. Really? Is it any good? What yeah. does it look like? What's the damage on uh, it? It is five. It's what? Oh, uh, uh, five hit points. Five, five damage. damage. Um, can you? I actually would like to use that. All yeah, go ahead. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll let it. Cause uh, Got a silver war. I actually prefer stabs and not daggers. There we go. I feel more human with a staff. Um, he's easy. I got chuck a bronze. Um, more gnome. I don't know. More gnome. Snap dragon razor. Yeah, see you later tonight, uh, Drag Racer. Thanks for stopping by. Get better offense. Play five. Back up. Now that he's hit me, Pep will actually do something. Tash and Enfeeblement. Yeah, uh, my the skill that uses heals is a skill that you don't start using from the first level with a mage. So when you get your first pet heal, you fizzle a crap ton. Yep. All right. I'm going to go hail this dude. No. Give him the item. Here, have a key. Yeah, busted locks complete. Get some gloves. Okay. So real quick. Um... We've killed two goblin slaves, and then we still need to find Rookfin the Goblin Shaman. Oh, there's a cobalt supply crate. Hey, no one. Can we get some ice? Thank you. Um, um let's head back and so I can uh, sell some stuff with my inventory's getting a bit full. Right. Oh, right. Mm. A utility. 
beneficial. I don't feel like whacking anything today, so. Invis. Oh. I would like to point out a flaw in your plan. <laughs> you have two goofballs trailing you that are not invisible and will aggro stuff. Uh, the mercs will if you're in Viz. The oh, okay. Will act oh, yeah, the mercs, the, the UI is, the, the AI smart of the CA, if you are in Viz, your pet, I, I think your pet, but at least your merc will be considered in Viz. Awesome. Okay. I'm actually going to sit here for a bit and get my mana back, if that's okay. Right. Yep. Fine. I'm about to mana myself. Here you go, Sully. Metric ton of crap. Morat says, I'm having a fun day at work. Woo. Woo. You have been caught charged a mercenary upkeep cost of zero plat, zero gold, and your mercenary upkeep cost timer has been reset to 15 minutes. Let's see what you're yep. talking about. I see what you're talking about now. Wow, nine silver apiece for these whips. <laughs> At least it's not copper. I mean, it's not like, oh, yeah. I looted a helmet that's worth one platinum, you know, but... Uh, at least it's not copper for, for the webs. Paul has, hey, says he started the download. One hour and 40 minutes remaining. Uh, not bad. Yeah, it's not bad, honestly, for as much of a game there is. I kind of think that I might keep this as a regular Thursday thing. It's kind of fun. Yeah. <laughs> now, granted, one thing I do think I want to try and find is a UI that makes stuff a little bit larger. And that's the problem. I went looking for one and was like, oh my god, I can't find one. There's UIs that are actually nice. Like, I showed you the one I'm using right now, but yeah. it, the text can be just small. Okay, spell particles, switch to... There's no UI scale. That is the problem. Because if you, if you want to do a UI scale, you have to do it in the actual UI XML files, which yeah. is absolute PETA. Because it'll scale the font but it won't scale the actual elements. So it's like, hey, I'll just scale this font up. That's easy. And you realize everything's sticking out of the bounding boxes. Did you actually pronounce the abbreviation for pain in the ass? Did you say uh, PETA? PETA, yes. You're a super nerd. You know that, right? <laughs> All right. I have actually been standing in front of somebody when uh, one person told a joke and the guy next to me went, lol. I was like, oh my God. It's like, I only do that to annoy people. Uh, <laughs> Ropple. Oh, Jesus. Ropple. Please. Stop. stop. Uh, okay. It's kind of cool. You're grouped up with me. I can see you. It is, the coloring on this is really oh, that's bad. The the, yes, the map coloring is just horrible. <laughs> but I think, yeah, I can see. No. I think you have to be within a certain range, but I saw you walk away on the map. Gotcha. So, which was very cool. I just fair for humanity, says Paul Hay. <laughs> you and me both, buddy. Okay, I'm at max uh, right, I'm mana. Back. You're not at max mana. You're going to sit down and get some back. Ugh. All right, since we finished that quest, I'll queue. Um, we've already got half of Scooting glo uh, Glooming Deep done. Scouting Glooming Deep. Yeah, Dig Site 1, Dig Site 2. Followed to Eastern Wall, enter the next tunnel. So we have to go farther. Okay. Uh, Rewards. That's half. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Quest reward for this is three platinum. Yeah, it was three plat for the, uh, oh my god. I have, locks too. I have five plat now. WTF. They're That's all. I was like, let's just do all the quests. This is like, yeah, plat. <laughs> Dude, when I was playing this game back at launch, you did not see platinum as a thing until like... For a while. Maybe level 20, level 30, possibly. 
You were stealing. Yeah, you were stuck with that most gold. Yeah, still silver and gold into your at least gold into your twenties. Are you here now? I'm here. Okay, you need to sit down and get your mana back. Uh, yep. two two robe wearers are no good without <laughs> mana. mana. <laughs> okay, so we have goblin treachery, which is goblin slaves, and then the goblin shaman. I'm gonna do a little bit of spell adjustment real quick. Yeah, go while, ahead. While I do have renewing elements, let's see what is this. Oh, I'm not going to be using that. Um, I'm going to move it a bit farther down the bar because while I can heal my pet, the mercenaries are still way better at it. Um, yes. So I think I am going to be more productive. Let's get this. I'm going to do Shock of Blades, a single target. There we go. And then I'm going to do... Shield of Fire there. Now, where was that thing? You feel magnanimous. Fire. Spirit. Firefly. <laughs> Magnanimous, really? No, yeah, that, that's the description of the, spell, the center spell and they cast yeah. it on you. You feel a magnanimous spirit. You have okay. been healed for so many hit points. Okay, so I actually have my point blank AoE. What is this? Awesome. Elemental Kim. Yeah, lesser shielding. I have my point blank AoE back on the bar. So oh, if awesome. we get ambushed, I can start pounding that thing out and doing damage to my Bap it. Um, okay. Just know that once you do, you're going to draw aggro like crazy. <laughs> That's true. Um, okay. It, we are actually, while we're making progress, it is actually five minutes till, or about seven minutes oh, till. So we don't have a lot of time. Do you want to just go find, wasn't there one of these adjacent hallways that had some goblin? Yeah, goblin slaves. You just want to pick off some of these guys real quick and get to that count of ten? Might as well. Okay. Um, I see a spirit weaver on the left. I think I'm going to take him out first, though. He yeah. Looks, he looks big and beefy. Let's send him over here. There you go. So he has Darn. a buff, too. Inner fire. Let's do that. Oh. My spell yeah, fizzled. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, God. What fire. is it about fizzling? There we go. People bend and crap. Shock of Blades! Okay, Vivarn is getting very, very low. Oh, never mind. Mercenaries got him. See? He'll get low, but they, they get him. This spirit weaver is nasty. I, I, I just blinded him with a new spell I had. Uh, he's dead. <laughs> there you go. Shock of blades, apparently. Holy crap! What? Dude, he's got a bunch of items on him. Really? Uh, like what? New staff. Same one you have. Oh. Yeah, he has a, he has a spell on him. The bard spell. Consume Chrono. What? Yeah, my staff is five damage based. It's got a delay, but... Oh, this is a one-handed yeah, blunt. Staff. What? This isn't a staff. This is a club. <laughs> I want a actual staff. This is dumb. Whatever. At least I feel like a caster. This item is placeable in yards, guild yards, houses, and guild walls. Okay. Strange. Ooh. <laughs> You're making ooh noises. What's going on? I... A uh, glooming steel blade was on him. Hmm. Okay, song. Cellos Accelerando. That's the Bard Speed song. I haven't seen that name yep. in so long. Can I give you the sword? Oh, God. No, I can't. Dang. Can I give you the sword? No. <laughs> I'll sell them. Is it two handed? Maybe they can't handle two handed weapons anymore. Oh, it's no trade. Oh, it's no that, trade. That would be why. Ha <laughs> ha. We just, we just I can't sell it either. Oh, well. Um, okay, awesome. Hey, you goblins. 
Let's pick on some goblins. Uh, you're a good candidate. Does he good still smart. have? No, he does not. Let's toss that on him. He's in height. Um. Oh, it's got his target right here in the. God, I feel dumb. My pet's target is right here in the pet window. I've been like clicking oh, yeah. on the thing. I feel like an imbecile. Um. <laughs> uh, eight seven six. I think it's. Yeah. Yep, that's I right. Fifty-two percent. My next level. He got nothing. He didn't have gold on him. Okay. Awesome. Um. Shock of fizzles. There we go. Shock, shock of blades. Fizzle. It's a shock of fizzles. Have a flame bolt. Now I can do this. <laughs> died right when you cast it. <laughs> Blah. Top them off. I'm gonna see. Rook. I'm gonna go loot this guy. I'm gonna root you. Loot. Uh, hey, uh, do I, get rooted. Do you want to loot all of the nothing? Why? Yes. Yes, I do. Well, let's do shock of blades. I'm gonna sit down for a sec. Oh, that guy's yep. dead. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I rooted. New. Yeah, I rooted. Cheated him. Enabled him, and then nuked him. He didn't last very long. <laughs> they got like nothing on them. I know. They didn't even have the currency. I'm not no. using any currency when you loot them. Oh, we're losing faction with the kobolds of glooming deep. Oh god. Oh, no. 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 I need to get some <laughs> back. Uh, um. What's this? Oh, countdown. You're We're resting at? and recovering health, mana, and endurance. Oh, you have a 30 second countdown hey. um, before you'll enter full meditation. Um, okay, it's longer on. if you're poisoned. Or an event like a ray will increase uh, the length of the re uh, of that timer. It's your mercenary's name, Barcelona. Oh, it's uh, Baylona. Baylona. Never mind. It's like, what the heck? You're missing an R to see. <laughs> oh God! Steam's got double fine publisher weekend day of the tentacle remaster for three dollars and twenty nine cents. I'm sorry, three pounds twenty nine pence. Uh, plus other games can be placed in yards. So yes, I have have a yard stick for a weapon, preacher. Also, <laughs> also hi, preach. What's going on? Recast my buffs on my pet. We're right at the end of the stream. Preach, are you streaming after this? There we go. Hey, you. Boom! Wow! <laughs> oh. An exhausted goblin's corpse. An exhausted goblin's corpse. Oh, hey, this guy's back. Nope, nope, nope. Get him! Shock of blades, baby. Ah, I fizzled. Jeez. Nope, Here 10 p.m. Go. tonight. Okay, Ranzer called it yesterday. He'll make a note of it until he forgets. Yeah, basically. Uh, I need to I need to I stick a po post-it note on the bottom of my monitor on when you and Ferg live stream and like when Trunks and I just need to make a note. Dang it. Look, another whip. Good grief. At least he had money on him. <laughs> Chunk of iron. Oh yeah. You can turn that in for a there. You can turn that in for a better weapon if you want to. Um Yeah, I already have a better club than that weapon, unfortunately. Man. Um, okay. Go Goblin Treachery. Seven out of ten slaves. We can just wrap this up real quick, probably. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um... 
Uh, um, if they will spawn. Is there anything back here? Nope, nothing back here. Just a bunch of diseased rats. I know, right? Aerodonny has lo has looted a cobalt whip again. Again. <laughs> so many. Gonna hit this barrel with my stick in anger. Grr. Grr. I'm oh. going to loot all of the nothing. Let's go hit more barrels. Oh, this isn't a hit barrel. Oh, okay. It's a decoration oh, barrel. Uh, okay. Goblin, you know what? How dare they? <laughs> uh, oh. I was trying to lure, I was trying to mend the spell. And you smacked me in the back of the head. Whoops. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, oh hello there. Yep. Um, let's do that. Root you. Fire! I do actually have, I just realized that, I did learn a uh, point-blank stun. Uh, point-blank AoE stun. Oh, cool. What's the best? Oh, I, I, I don't even want to know how much mana it takes, though. Um... <laughs> Do do do. Yep, target point blank AE. 20 mana, that's not bad actually. The rat had more stuff than the goblin slaves. I'm gonna sit um, okay. I am out of mana. <laughs> you go over there. You have yourself a good old time there, the barn. Insufficient mana to cast this spell. Okay. Well, hey, guess what? I'm gonna. I would like to point out that the mercenaries are at full energy. Yeah. Would you equip resisting? Thank you. Out of mana, you jerk. Crap. He's just having a good old-fashioned beatdown of my Earth Elemental. I know. <laughs> Nothing. Oh god, we're losing more faction with the Cobalts of Glooming Deep. Oh no. We need one more Goblin. One more Goblin, come here. <laughs> yeah, it's true. And then we just need the named one. Yep. Uh, ain't, oh, there we go. Insufficient mana to cast a spell. Deck up 1% mana. I'm out. <laughs> I did some damage to him. There we go. Task stage complete. Goblin slave. Whacking on your butt, Aerodonny. Now your pet's on it. <laughs> pet, get him. Oh, I tell you what I can do. I can put fire shield on your pet. Now anything Whoosh. that hits it will take damage. <laughs> um, okay. Let's get the heck out of here. I think it's back up this way, right? Yes, I have a floating whip and feather duster. Um, <laughs> floating whip and feather duster in air as a pet. Yeah. Um, he's actually um he he actually cons level nine. So he's actually more powerful than we are. What your air pet? Yeah. Oh, huh, okay. Weird. Um, okay. So just real quick, we're going to wrap things up here. Um, <laughs> okay, I'm level seven still, but I think I'm close to... I'm level seven, I'm at 73% through my level. Yeah, 75... Uh, I'm at 75% on my level for eight. We're getting eight. Awesome. Yep. I have water elemental... Let me think. Okay, there's elemental kin, water, fire, air, 
and earth. We're cur currently using the elemental kin. That is the base, quali base quality level. So I yep. have water and fire for the next step up. What I think I'm going to do... Let's get adventurous. Adventurous. And uh, I can't remember. Let's see. Let's get this up here. Uh, I think I can. Oh, I have a taunt button for my Earth pet. I wonder if that does anything. Okay, pet taunt. Sure, why not? I'll put that over here on the bar. Um, let's see. I am going to do... Oh, yeah. I gotta stand up. Do this. Oh. Here we go. You can only you cannot have more than one pet at a time. Oh my god. Okay, hang on a sec. Um Do this, do this. I'm gonna do This is complicated. Um There we go. He goes away. And next Thursday, we can see. Wow. There we go. How the fire pet does. I think it's going to have a whole. Ah, see? Fire elemental aura permanent. What is that? Oh, probably a permanent dot or a uh, dot aura. You think a permanent fire shield? Yeah. Okay, that could um, be interesting. I don't know what kind of spells he is going to have. Summons a fire elemental pet to aid you in battle. Not not sure beyond that. Um, but I mean, we can see how he does. Maybe he will be better or worse. My worry is he's not going to have as many hit points and not going to have as much armor rating as the Earth one. But yeah. in theory, the next level up at eight, I will get the air pet, which means it will have some stuns that it can whip out and it might be a little bit yep. better until I can get the better Earth pet. And then we'll probably oh, stick we with that for a while. Uh, fire elemental aura. Increase damage shield by a number depending on level and increase fire resist by five. So yeah, he's got a damage shield essentially. From that one. A Ferg raid? What? Wait a minute. I do believe Ferg is streaming at the main. Shall we raid after you finish? Oh, if he is, yeah, we need to. We need to Ferg raid. Paul Hay says, if you get heart as well, Vagram, I'm uninstalling. What does that mean? What? I think I, I missed a word there somewhere, Paul. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to I'm gonna sit down. Uh, boop. Because I, I am tapped. I have 30% mana and I need more. Uh, We are going to log out here. Thank you very much, everybody. Let's go to the creepy face cam because I know Preacher loves it. There we go. And um, uh, we're going to toss everyone over to a Ferg raid. Is this channel just Fergcraft, right? It should be, yeah. Um, thank you very much, everybody, for... Oh, there we go. Dark Preacher hit it. Woohoo! Have a good one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.